everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Uh, I want to apologize um, for my computer because the fan is being ridiculously loud. And also, sorry for not doing the flash. I'll be doing that Monday along with Era. So, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, so, anyway, we're doing season four, episode 14 of Supergirl called Stand and Deliver. So, we start off with the Lee are leaving a bar. And they're trying to get on uh, to do a mission. But Dreama and Supergirl and Martian Manhunter got Menagerie and take her. Then we cut to where Lockwood got attacked by the Elite, but Supergirl saved him. And I guess this is a support staff. Uh, then the Elite managed to escape. Then we cut to where James talks to Eve. And she covers for Elcorp about the black... Um, the, the, the secret money. <laughs> I'm tired tonight, y'all. This daily same time is really messing with me. So then we cut to Relina, um, but says with Haley because she wants it done ASAP with the whole superhero thing for the soldiers. But she's like, I'm taking my time. Your people are not ready. The medicine's not ready, so we're not doing that. Then we cut to where Menagerie is at the DEO because, um, they cannot keep her long enough because they just keep telling her about their bad fashion sense. <laughs> so they're just like, we're just going to drop you off. We can't deal with this. And then we catch up with the president, told Alex to work for security to Lockwood. And she is not happy about it at all. <laughs> then we cut to where uh, John um, hates the feeling that, he, uh, that the elite makes him feel. Oh crap, my battery's going dead. Wonderful. <laughs> so I'm going to try to fly through the rest of this, so sorry in advance. So Allison, Lockwood, butt heads, and then have a, have a press conference, and he's going to be repealing the Alien Astamity Act. Uh, that means everyone gets struck, of, all the aliens get struck of their powers, and they all got to go home to bye-bye to their own planet. Then Haley wants Brainy to hack a pro-alien rally um, under the, uh, and the organizers of the American Alien. Then the Elite is at the Fortress of Solitude, and they managed to get in because of the guy with the hat. He has a spe um, special tools to uh, um, lift up the key, because we have a drug store, and they get into the, the Fortress. Then we cut to where Dreama um, located them, so they get there, and they, like, square off. And But Manchester went through a door that had a Sun Eater in it. Then we cut off with Supergirl, drops off the alien. Because they managed to capture the, the invisible one. Then Haley sends the troops to um, to the alien rally and sent Brainy to um, head that so that way nothing insane happens. Then we cut to where the door, like I said, okay, we cover that. Then James talks to a reporter and um, that's going to the march and he's going to go as well and take pictures. Then we cut to where Brainy is an American alien because he confessed it to Kara or one of them. And then uh, was not to march, but they're going to patrol. Then we cut to where Lockwood's rally um, is happening. Then we have the alien rally and Kara Zorel is marching. And, and like her like official attire and stuff. And then we cut to where Manchester is still alive with the hat guy and they start stirring up a ruckus. Then we cut to where Brainy is versus Hats, and he wins, so that was pretty cool. And then we cut to where John versus Manchester, but um, when he was getting really aggressive with the guy, but it turns out it wasn't him, it was just a, ch a child of liberty that had um, some type of hologram thing to make it look like Manchester and everything. And then we cut to where Lockwood um, stopped the repeal for... Uh, then we see the, uh, the whole um, thing... Um, where the, basically both sides help each other out, they help each other up and uh, send them out. And we have a Children of Liberty guy helping an alien guy, and James was taking all these pictures and everything. So that was super cool to watch. It's like everyone was coming together for a purpose. So Lockwood is going to um, is stopping the repeal for now, and then we cut to where Haley is going out to praise, which was odd because she rarely, rarely, rarely does that. Uh, then also gives Haley, um, gives Lena a break, but she's going to push forward anyway, so she's not going to take a break. She's going to keep on going. 
And then we cut to where John is trying to find Manchester Black and it's getting very kind of obsessed with that and getting like not in the right headspace about it. Then someone uh, shot at James in the back and he's on the ground bleeding out. And that's in the episode. Um, <clears throat> okay, I really like this episode so I'm going to give it a A. And props to whoever come up, came up with the ending because I did not see that coming so that was super cool. Uh, the fight scenes were great. The whole message was great. I usually don't like the whole interactions with children, liberty, and the civil war, and blah blah blah, and all these rallies and all that type of stuff. But for the, you know, it is what it is. I'm just trying to move past that. So that's why I didn't get like a full on A plus. I was like a more like in the A A minus territory. But um, Lex Lex, Lex Luthor will be in the next episode, so that's gonna be really interesting. I'm super excited for that. So anyway. That's wonderful for this video, so if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree? Just tell me your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe, it helps out the channel a lot, and sorry if, if my speed talking, if I talk too much, too fast. Anyway, subscribe, bye.